What's uh, going on with your you had, were you up leg cramps? Or? I had whole lower body cramps. Uh, the first time I went down was my right hamstring, and then the second time was uh, both my calves and then my hip all just locked up on me. And terrible feeling, so uh, I'm good now. Uh, talk to the doctors, nutritionists, and everything. And uh, we're going to fix that, so hopefully I won't go down again cramping. Just hydration thing, you think? Uh, hydration was good. Uh, didn't really eat much throughout the day. Um, but now we're going to fix all that. I've been talking to the nutritionists, and uh, they got me on a couple of things that I'm taking. So hopefully I don't have to go through that again. How practice getting ready for this game? Is there a different level of, of emotion going into this yeah, one? Yeah, I, I would say so. I feel like it's a, a different emotion. I feel like because of, just because of the win we just had against Wisconsin, it's a big win for us. And, uh, you know, now we get to go play uh, our rival Michigan State. So uh, I could definitely see a switch in the focus, and uh, we're pretty amped up for it and can't wait. How do you keep that focus under control? Like when you have a big win like that to not get, like, overconfident? Yeah, that, that, that's the thing about it. You know, you don't want to get too overconfident or, or too hyped up too early. We want to, you know, play our game the right way, um, execute the game plan that the coaches give us throughout the week and just uh, try to, uh, you know, get all our mistakes out early in the week so we don't have to – you know, uh, go through those pains on Saturday. So just uh, just stay in focus, but also, you know, we know it's a big game, so just try to stay even kill. What challenges does Lurky present? I mean, he's good on his feet. He uh, he throws a, a ball, a good ball, quick release. Um, I think this is like his third year in the system, so he, he's, he's really comfortable back there, and you could just tell watching the film, and uh, he's, he's going to be a challenge for us. How much, how much is the secondary uh, talked about Felton Davis? I mean, uh, just, you know, we, we, we talk about all the, the, the guys we go against and, you know, we just try to, you know, play our game as we can as, as a secondary and, and trust each other and, and have each other's back throughout the game. We don't try to focus on no individual, really. We just try to go out and play our game. How much is your, we started talking about your experience last year, but I mean, you've been, been there, done that with this rivalry. How much is your experience kind of rubbing off on some of the younger players? I mean, I feel like it's good, not just me, just all the guys that have been playing. They, they got key roles on this team. Uh, they're feeding off a lot of the older guys, a lot of the guys that are playing. And there, there's some guys that, that feed off the younger guys that are, are doing well. So, uh, I mean, we just we just try to show a good example in the locker room and on the field. And, and I feel like we've been doing that good, a good thing that, like that this year. So just got to keep that moving. Our team will get better as that goes on. When you're working as a captain, you and Devin, do you, do you cross over with the offensive players too? Or do you, are you just... Feel like you captain the defensive guys. Yeah, we uh, we uh, have a lot of conversations together. Um, Coach Harbaugh gave us a choice of the team movie last week for the first time, so we had a good conversation with the captains to pick the movie. So which was? Um, it's actually funny. We picked the uh, Three Hundred, the Spartans. So. <laughs> Uh, but that was last week. It won't be, we definitely won't watch that this week. Why, why, why 300s last uh, week? We thought that was a, a good movie to watch, uh, a good war movie, good fighting movie. I uh, thought it would be a good movie to watch before a game. Um, we, didn't, we didn't really realize that, the, you know, the Spartan thing until it was on, that we played them the next week. But uh, we won't be watching it this Friday. You really didn't realize? I mean, I mean some people might have did, but, like, as the captains, as we were discussing it, we didn't realize it at first. So. Are you going to one-up it this week with the movie? Um, I, w I think we think we might be going with Friday Night Lights. I'm not sure, but we'll, we'll discuss it together as a as a captains again. And, uh, and I think we, we like it like that. Coach Harbaugh giving us the option to, to pick the team movie on Friday night, so we like it like that. What is a what is a movie night like, especially before a game like this? I mean, it's really chill and relaxed. You know, you just get the you 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 practice all week so hard, and you finally get to Friday and just kind of relax and focus on the game plan and come together as a team and just watch a movie together. It's, it's, it's pretty relaxing and it's a cool thing to do. Get your get your mind ready for the game. Has uh, Coach Harbaugh um, given the captains any other um, decisions to make? I mean, no, it's, it's just we just pretty much, you know, we lead. We try to lead uh, as captains uh, in the locker room, on the field, by our actions and, you know, what we do outside, outside of football. I mean, uh, every everyone is a leader on this team. Everyone's been following the right lead. So, uh, captain wise, we, we just try to you know just uh, try to do it by example. How is Josh Metellus going? I think Jim said it was his best game as a Wolverine last on Saturday. He's been doing good, and I like I see it firsthand. Being right by him, being right by him in the meeting room every day, being by him in practice, and seeing him in the game. It's like his confidence level is extremely high. Um, you know, he's, he's playing super hard, and, and I think. That's just credit to like you know him himself, but like the coaches as well. Uh, they've been on us extremely hard, especially since the week one of Notre Dame game. Um, and, and I feel like we're just taking all the coaching in and playing really well. 
Did how, he much, change? Uh, how much do you practice against Shea, and does practicing against him prepare you for some of the um, skills that Lurki has? Uh, we, we practice against our offense uh, just a little bit on uh, Tuesday and Wednesday, and then. Uh, but it's, it's good going against Shea. Um, you know, he, he's really good. He uh, he makes plays outside the pocket, just like like you said. Um, so it's good going against our offense, and it's a good to see like see that type of look, you know, to get us ready for other offenses. Are you seeing his play kind of? You know, improve each week. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's improved, but take another level. Yeah, not just him, just the whole offense. I feel like they've been playing extremely well, getting better every week um, with the offensive line and Karan and Chris and and True. They all have a higher confidence with the offensive line. The receivers are playing good, and, and I'm just excited, you know, just to see them play every week. Every week, we don't really see a lot of teams trying to get two trips.